Hi, today I give you idea about addressing modes in microprocessor 8085 and through this my lecture you will find those topics what is addressing modes in microprocessor 8085 how many types of addressing modes in microprocessor 8085 and details of different types of addressing mode with proper example which you may understand better way now come to our first question what is addressing mode in microprocessor 8085 look in microprocessor 8085 every instruction which is indicates an operation to be performed on certain data inside a microprocessor means every instruction we are given to microprocessor 8085 for doing some operation it just process some data now there has some method to specify the data for the instruction and this process is known addressing modes remember that the execution unit of microprocessor can access all register and data which is stored in register or immediate operands but it cannot access data on memory address so we need some special method to access data from memory location and this is also called addressing modes now how many types of addressing modes in microprocessor 8085 in 8085 microprocessor there are mainly five addressing mode those are direct addressing mode register addressing mode register indirect addressing mode immediate addressing mode and implicit addressing mode now come to details about different type of addressing mode first direct addressing mode in this mode the operand is specified within the instruction itself that means in instruction we can find the source and destination where data is being accessed because address is given in operation take an example LDA 4000H that means in 4000H address there will be some data this data would be load in accumulator so now you can see to load a data from direct address we can use this instruction LDA 4000H and also same thing is happening in STA STA 5513H means uh, using this instruction we can send data which is stored in accumulator to this specific address 5513H now second topic register addressing mode in this mode of addressing the operand is in the general purpose register and data operation done between the register mode like move a comma b that means the content of b will be moved to con content of a third addressing mode is register indirect addressing mode look it is very important uh, the example I give in first to make you understand better way the example of this type of indirect addressing mode is move a comma n look this instruction is one byte instruction and instead of specifying a register a register pair is specified to accommodate the 16 bit address of the operand now I tell you more to make you understand easily look in instruction move a comma m where m is a register but it contains data of address which is initialized in HL pair say HL pair initialize address C050 that means if we use move a comma m instruction actually the data of C050 is transferred to accumulator look in this way we can indirectly move the data of specified register to accumulator that is why it is called register indirect addressing the fourth one is immediate addressing it is easy one we generally use MBI A07 ADI 0F or anything 
are the in this categories addressing mode the operand is immediately specified in the instruction in this mode here the operand address is not specified but direct work with data like if we use mvi a07 instruction that means in accumulator directly 07 is loaded or move you can say move the last addressing mode is implicit addressing mode in this mode of addressing the operand is fully absent look the example rar ral cma look no operand is there now take a example of rar rar means rotate accumulator right if we use this command actually it rotate the binary bit position of the data which is contained in accumulator let uh, some take a example uh, in accumulator uh, containing 07 and if we break in binary uh, that will be 0 0 0 0 1 1 1 now if we perform RAR instruction then accumulator data will be 1 0 0 0 0 0 1 1 means 83 see using RAR instruction the last bit of 0 7 is rotate right side so it is in now 83 